Well, welcome my fellow Drifty Maniacs, Richie here, and this is my Top 10 RC Kits for 2019. Now, in this video, I've tried to cover quite a wide cross-section of products, from fast stuff to quite slow stuff, because crawler kits were one of the big uh, impacts on the RC kit market this year. I've covered a wide range of budgets, uh, from high to low, and quite a few in between. So, I hope you like the Top 10 RC Kits for 2019. Do have your cart say in the comment section below the video as to which one you would buy if you had the money, or which one you may have already bought or got for Christmas. Anyway, let's get straight down to it. Well, this year's RC kit scene has been pretty much dominated by crawlers, as we will see in just a few moments' time. But the one brand that started it for many of us out there is Tamiya, and the Tamiya Bugya Rat Bugya Fat Fox. And somebody please do correct me on your pronunciation on that has proved a very popular one this year. Steve OD 313RC on YouTube did a build off competition of these where uh, 12, 13 people built up one of these trucks. It comes complete with everything you need included in the box. He says, other than a two channel radio, a steering servo and paint for the body and a battery and battery charger. So it just comes with a brushed motor and the ESC included as do many Tamiya parts. They also do other trucks in this range. However, the Bugyarat Fat Fox 1 was the one I opted for at number 1. Now, speaking of those crawler kits, and I will put a link to that Tamiya kit below this video, as I will do for the Axial Capra 1.9 Unlimited Trail Buggy Rock Crawler Builders Kit. Now, they have released, since this came out, a ready-to-run version, but this is a very appealing car to a lot of people. This car features a dig unit attached to the car where the rear axle can be locked, disengage completely etc etc please do google that to figure out exactly what a dig unit is now as it says here this model is shown finished for illustration purposes only you will need to finish it da, 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 a three channel radio system esc and motor high torque servo and a battery and battery chargers you'll also need to get tires and paint for the car so it doesn't come with anything at all i wasn't sure if it came with tires but it doesn't come with tires either the three channel radio system is needed for operating the dig unit on the axle capra and they have a series of videos on the a main site where you can see that dig unit in operation and one of my friends has built one of these up and from what i have seen from his videos of it the performance of this thing is second to none and that dig unit enables you uh, to turn much tighter radius turns than your traditional uh, four-wheel drive a rock crawler would do. Anyway, there isn't to this below the video, but at number three we have the kit that Richie always promised himself that one of these days he would buy, and it's the Kyosho Inferno MP10 18 Nitro Buggy Kit. Yours for $699 which is one of the reasons why yours truly has not invested in this as yet because on top of that you're also going to need a nice hot race tuned engine as well as your RC gear to steer and control the car with but all in all you are buying a world class piece of machinery here this is the kind of thing with a bit of tuning uh, you could go and run a serious club level racing on here having seen these in person the thing is extremely well engineered you will now be in nitro it's got two servos one for steering and one for the brake and the throttle and you will need a separate battery pack included to power that as well but having seen the build of these cars i would say there's maybe not a kit uh, for you to attempt as a beginner while well, you're getting everything pretty much included in the box So you're gonna need things like tires uh, and as I said the engine engine could run you to several hundred dollars for a top-class Competitive engine as well. It is a cracking kit. It is a I do recognize it is quite a big budget one So let's move on to something with a little bit smaller budget and that comes in the form of the Traxxas Stampede 4x4 monster truck kit now this comes in two variants which I will, one of which I've got, but not this one. This one is a 249.99. The one I got is a 199.99. The difference being this one comes with all the electronics in terms of uh, servo, ESC, motor, and radio included with it. So you're not gonna have to do much more than assemble the thing and paint the body. However, 
that does represent a pretty good value. Bear in mind the kit without the electrics is just $50 less. So even if you wanted to change all of the electrics and everything out, I would say it's worth spending that extra $50 just to get those Traxxas electronics, even if you're just going to keep them as spares for your other car. Now, speaking of spares, you will be able to get spares from pretty much any model store anywhere in the world for the Traxxas Stampede 4x4. Huge amount of mods out there, and I just thought that one worthy of inclusion uh, in here. As I say, reach over 30 miles an hour uh, with the optional pinion gear which you do have to buy uh, for it but that is a pretty much household brand name product on there and well worth the consideration either at 199 or 24995 now let's crawl along to the next one which is the Element RC Enduro Sendero 1 10th Rock Crawler Builders Kit. As I said, the Crawler Builders Kits are becoming the in thing. I think four or five major brands are releasing them this year. Uh, now, I have reviewed this car down at JJ Customs. Uh, I believe even the blue one is showing on there, but I've also seen it in grey down there. No, it was the grey one that I reviewed. I did take a step back uh, on that one. But the Builders Kit doesn't come with any of that stuff. Nobody, no wheels, no tyres, no electronics on this thing. You are literally getting kit of parts. You add your own electrics in terms of uh, receiver, motor, ESC, etc, etc on there. But you are then free to fit your own body, wheels and tyres on there. Uh, tyres being a big thing that can affect the performance of a crawler. Uh, that is why so many of these crawling kits have come out without literally the bare bones kit on there so that you can go and fit all your own goodies uh, onto the car. A uh, huge range of option parts already for the uh, Element RC Enduro on there and it's gaining quite a cult following. Wide range of uh, gear parts etc etc to fit to the thing. So all in all not too bad at all I would say. 239.99 is a little more than some of the other builder kits out there as we'll come on to uh, in just a second uh, but this is definitely one of the brands that is uh, sort of punching above its weight this year I would say. So, let's move on swiftly to the next one. Just remember guys, if you like what you see today, don't forget to subscribe. And I say swiftly, as with the team associated RC8 18th four-wheel drive brushless electric RC off-road kit from Banggood, you will be going very swiftly, very fast indeed. And this is what caught my eye. It's down from just over $600 to $329.99 at the minute you're going to have to fit your own wheels uh, you're going to have to fit your own tires to it but it does come with wheels you're also going to have to fit all of your own electrics to it but you are buying a proven weight race winning uh, chassis this thing literally comes as a kit of parts for you to assemble and tweak and tune just the way you want to but you are buying proven team associated rc8 race quality car on there the thing just oozes quality just check out that carbon fiber plate on the top of the diff cover so uh, it screams out speed from the absolute outset link to this car below the video anyway let's move slowly on to the next one and that would be the trail proven axial scx 10 2 raw builders kit uh, familiar to everyone out there i'm sure as i say it is one of the cheaper ones out there a 199 or is that the enduro one just looking a little bit expensive at 239 however this is a proven platform lots of bonds uh, available on the market out there for this particular uh, raw builders kit and truck on here uh, shown below you can see that some of the variants uh, out on here but there is a huge range of uh, parts in terms of bodies wheels tires etc available for this doesn't come with any electrics you're going to need to fit uh, receiver esc steering servo etc etc on there no batteries no charger included but being a raw builders kit you are going to be able to fit exactly what you want to it and as i mentioned earlier the lack of wheels and tires is probably an advantage uh, for a crawler on there you can see the full spec on uh, using the link below the video there are links below the video to all of the cars that i'm showing on here today so moving on swiftly again we have the techno rc mt4 ton electric 4x4 pro monster truck kit yours for 449 from my main hobbies link to it below the video now 
this is not just a like a basic bare bones cheap plastic kit uh, that many people may consider some of the Traxxas variants to be, uh, although that is questionable, I would say. Uh, this is based on the Harley Crane ET48 platform, which has raised the highest levels of competition in monster trucks out there. Um, so whether you're just interested in adding a few upgrades to it or building a highly tunable truck from the outset then this one could well be for you. Now it is shown with electrics on here uh, but it doesn't come with any of the electrics included. You are buying a bare bones truck on here. As I say, needed to complete, you're going to need two channel radio and transmitter. Uh, you're also going to need a monster truck body and paint or equivalent size of body on here. Uh, 1 8 scale ESC and motor system, high torque steering servo, uh, 4S battery, LiPo battery on air, which they recommend for this, and a 1 8 scale monster truck wheels and tyres on here. So you are literally just getting the bare bones chassis uh, with the car, but you are buying a race proven product which is going to uh, hammer around the track at a fairly decent pace. I'll link to it below the video. Well before we move on to number 10 I have from Banggood I found the Secura D4 uh, GTR uh, as in Nissan GTR Secura Drift Car. Now this kit is $279.99. Now you might be thinking that sounds quite a bit for a drift car kit rich with no electrics. Well this is a kit in the traditional sense uh, in terms of it comes with all of your electrics included with it. Quite a decent spec on it with a radio link, transmitter and receiver on here. But you will note in this picture at the top here, ladies and gentlemen, we have a censored ESC and censored brushless motor on there as well as a LiPo charger included with it. So you can see why that price of $279.99 suddenly looks rather attractive for the Sakura D4 car from Banggood. So I'll put a link to that one below the video. Anyway, let's crawl along to number 10. And that would be one that's released just the last week, which is the actual SMT10 Monster Truck Raw Builders Kit. As featured on the Great Digger and before that the Max DSMT10 uh, version of as well. Now this is the bare bones kit. You need to fit your own electrics uh, in terms of motor, ESC and radio gear on here. It doesn't come with a body, doesn't come with wheels or tyres either. So it is very bare bones builder's kit. Uh, you might have thought as I'm, I think maybe a few people thought this would come with monster truck tires with it and maybe a clear body. Uh, it is yet to be announced what bodies are going to come out for the SMT10. So you might want to hesitate a little bit uh, before laying out on this one. Um, because you're not going to be able to get the old Gravedigger body or SMT10 bodies because they are uh, currently discontinued. Although I would think the new Gravedigger body uh, is going to obviously fit on this chassis but then if you're going for the grave digger look you would probably gonna go and want to buy the grave digger with the green uh, roll cage underneath it rather than trying to spray this one uh, green because having done similar things in the past all that green paint will chip off very easily indeed uh, they are now available for pre-order using it from Amain using the link uh, below the video but lots and lots of mods out there for these I had my Max D1 running on 4S absolute blaster drive yet at the same time um, very much designed for crawling along with it's not necessarily designed as a speed run so it's sort of the only thing that goes against it is it almost sits it's not quite a fully fledged monster truck in the way that some of the Traxxas and uh, armor stuff are yet neither is it a dedicated crawler so it's like a halfway house on some stuff uh, but still it's I'm sure it's going to prove highly popular uh, particularly at this price point of 199 and quickly scanning down you will already see different tire choices available for you to pick from the A main website so there we have it that is my top 10 RC kits for 2019 a lot of couple of these have just been released in the past few weeks and as I say the RC kit market this year pretty much dominated by uh, the things like the Element Enduro, the SCX10, the Capra Unlimited etc. Crawlers are where it is at in terms of RC car kits this year Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and do consider subscribing. Thanks for watching. 
Well, thumbs up if you like this video, guys. Post any comments you might have in the comment section below the video and hit the circle below to subscribe. And if you do hit the circle, don't forget to hit the bell.